Luckily here, and I'm sorry for, you know, being a little bit inactive recently. Uh, that's really because I haven't, you know, had any ideas. I, d I do have ideas now for some videos I'm going to be making probably tomorrow or at least in a couple of days. But for now, this is... This is a bit of a more serious topic. Um, I'm sorry for the messy table. You know, that's that's going to happen. You've probably gotten used to it by now. What little audience I have left. Um, this is kind of serious topic. It's kind of, it's actually really serious. Um, if you're a part of, like, the Transformers community, you know, you, like... You look at reviewers, um, and you watch their content. Uh, a really good example is Panda Prime. Some of you have probably heard of him. He's a really cool guy. Uh, he reviews he reviews Transformers. He reviews other stuff. He does other stuff. You know, he he looks for the stuff. You know, he looks for the figures in stores. Uh, this isn't about him, for se. It's it's about a person who has been picking on him for, like, a while now, like, well over a fucking year. Um, you probably have heard of him, uh, but for those of you who haven't, uh, his name is Scottimus Prime, or at least that's what people refer to him. I don't really give a shit what his fucking name is, because he's a piece of shit, like an actual fucking cunt, because he has been harassing the shit out of some Transformer YouTubers. And I don't know why the fuck he does it. I don't even think the people who are getting bullied know why the fuck he does it, but he does. And it's actually really fucking stupid. Because the fucking guy just picks on these fucking kids. And they're younger than me. I've seen them. Like, Panda Prime, I think he's like 14 or 15. I'm sorry, Panda, if I got your age wrong, but, like, like, this is just fucking, he's a piece of shit, like a scumbag, like, he looks like the guy that would just fuck your grandma while staring at you, like, with this stupid smug look on his face. <laughs> like, honestly, this dude needs to, like, fucking get hit by a car. Or just get the fuck out of his mom's house, cause that I've seen him, and he's definitely the guy that would just be living in his mom's basement, while like fapping to some fucking grandma hentai. But like, he's been fucking sending Panda Prime bomb threats. He's even like fucking revealed their like addresses where they fucking live, and it's actually it's just a fucking cowardly thing to do to do that. Because, like, why the fuck would you, why would you send bomb threats and fucking pick on this kid who has done nothing to you, like, absolutely nothing, has probably never even heard of your bitch ass. And sorry if I'm, like, complaining a lot, but this is just fucking pointless and stupid. Like, why do you do it, dude? Like, you can't just review Transformers and be a loyal fan. Like, you have to pick on other people. You think you're better than them. You're fucking not, dude. Like, <sighs> sorry. Like, I, I've already said I've already dropped the f bomb more than fucking Hiroshima. Oh my god. Like, like he, he, if you've seen this dude, he looks like just an absolute like scumbag. Like. Panda has been threatened, his channel has been, like, harassed. He, he's even said that he may have to take down his channel, which, that would just devastate some people. Like, he's even been threatened to take down his Instagram. Like, just give the dude a fucking brick. Like, he doesn't do anything wrong. He just reviews Transformers and looks for them. Like, who does that? Who just, like, sees this dude and is like, you know what, I'm gonna send this dude a fucking bomb. Because I don't like him. And it's like, well, why? Huh? You just you just don't like him because he, he's probably better than you. He's probably better at reviewing shit than you. He's probably more funny. 
I mean, I've seen the dude, and like, I subscribe to Panda Prime. He's he's cool. I like the dude. He he doesn't do anything wrong. He just he literally has just chill streams, chill streams where he just chills and looks at Instagram. I mean, how could you just pick on the dude like that? Like, why? And like. I know, like, some people would just hate, just to hate, but, like, this is taking a bit too far. Like, you're picking on this dude for no other reason than to do it. And it's just, you don't have anything better to do. Like, you can't just review the Transformers and be a happy person. You have to fucking threaten this dude. You have to, like, call him a punk ass. You have to fucking just pick on this kid. Who has done nothing to you. Absolutely nothing. And for those of you who are subscribed to his channel. Please unsubscribe. And get yourself on medication. Because that dude is just. I'm sorry Panda Prime. I'm sorry Shane Productions. You got your channel shut down. That That just fucking sucks dude. Like. Honestly, I could never have thought of another. I could never have think of like a worse punishment than having your entire career taken from you in like the blink of an eye. His channel needs to be shut down. He needs to be banned from YouTube. He is the scum on your shoe that you need to pick off, and it's probably time that he needs to be dealt with before this gets taken on any further I've I've seen Panda Prime and I'm sorry about this dude it it has to suck a lot to be like picked on and harassed for like over a year now it may have been even longer than this cuz I can remember videos that they back to like June of last year where he's like talking about this fucking dude who's been picking on him and he just needs to like just fuck off like, it's actually pointless, and it's hip hypocritical, and overall, you're just being a jackass. Like, like holy shit. Anyways, guys, this has just been another fucking rant about society and YouTube and people who think they're better than others. You stay safe out there, Panda Prime. I'm probably going to send this video to you. But you take care of yourself, and we will deal with this fucking, this fucking kid, or whatever. I don't care who he is. I don't care about his past life, because it matters who you are now, and what you're doing now is fucked up, and you need to stop. Alright. Peace out, homies. Yeet.